Hey guys, welcome to another episode. Cooking with the Reaper, your heavy metal chef. Hey, we got a simple, authentic recipe for you tonight. You guys are going to like it. At least I hope you're going to like it. We're doing spaghetti as leo e olio. It originates in Naples, Italy. Very simple pasta. Very minimal ingredients. It's known as a poor man's pasta. So there's actually no cheese in this pasta. Of course, you can always add cheese if you like. We got our water here getting ready to boil. And we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna be generous with the salt. Because you wanna season your pasta with that. Okay? Well, guys, you don't need oil in your pasta to keep it from sticking. Pasta, pasta's meant to be used uh, as it's ready. Right? But uh, we got some basic ingredients. Extra virgin olive oil. Good quality olive oil, guys. You're gonna want about, about a half a cup. Because that's what we're gonna use. You don't wanna use a whole cup. That's like 16 tablespoons, that's way too much. It needs about 10. I think we got in the pan. And we're just gonna turn that on. A nice medium low heat. Alright. Of course we got our garlic. Remember guys, give that sucker a smash. And look. Look how easy the peel comes out. You want to use fresh garlic, guys. Alright? Don't mind the bag. It's for the garbage. That way, don't fling it all over the place, all over the floor. Well, well you know, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm famous for making messes, right? That's Gunji. He'll tell you. <laughs> Remember, give that sucker a smash. The peel comes right off. That one's for you, Vincenzo. Because I was watching you slice your garlic. I'm like, oh, do it the quick way. Smash it. <laughs> Vincenzo's awesome. Vincenzo's plate. Go ahead and lift him up there. But you want to cut your garlic in small pieces. Okay? Rule of thumb. And about one clove per person. All right? Got about four people gonna munch on this, so. Keep your digits back, guys. You don't wanna be that one, right? <laughs> the one that loses your digits. You know, I like the rubber stoppers on my cutting board. But sometimes they really aggravate me. Gets in the way of my cutting, slicing. But look, guys. See how small that garlic is, guys. And man, smell that flavor. Yes. It's awesome. Alright. Nice and fine. Enjoy that right now. Right? And you can add more if you want. Just to your, 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 however you would like it. Look guys, and we're gonna do parsley, but we're gonna use the stems. Fine sliced, right? Why? Because that's where all your flavor is. 
Okay. Parsley, if you don't want it. A lot of people don't like parsley. There's other things you can use for it, but then you sort of get away from the authentic of the recipe. Okay? Gonna put the stems right in there as well. Sorry guys, forgot my scraper. And this is fresh parsley. Okay? Alright. You got more parsley in your mouth. More parsley? Oh, thanks buddy. Yeah. Good eye, Gunge. Gunji. Oh, I ain't eating that. Got green stuff in it. He's gonna like it. You know, we have an agreement. He at least tries everything that we're, we're making. Right? Yep. All right. Remember, guys, you wanna, you wanna chop it. You don't wanna smash it. Okay? This here, we're just, this is gonna be for after. Oh yeah, smell that. Nothing like fresh parsley. Why is it on? Yeah, you got enough. Don't wanna overpower. I remember when I was younger, eating parsley potatoes, man. Parsley potatoes, good stuff. Yeah, butter, parsley, garlic, woo! Remember, chopping it fine. Chopping it fine. I'm going to set this aside for later. on our pasta water to get ready. I'll be right back, guys. Hey, guys. Welcome back. Right. We got our pasta and we had Gunchy test it. And it is El Dante, but I need to go. So we're going to go right into the oil. The whole pound of pasta. Don't worry about the water. It's 
gonna go part of our drink, our, our sauce. And you, you know, we want it. Look, and none of that pasta stuck together, guys. See, you don't need oil in your water. I do use a lot of oil in my water noodles, but not all of them. Stuff's expensive. get this all mixed together get all these flavors together and you know I didn't there's plenty of water in that pan for these noodles to dance around in that pot and fall in love with that salt water oh yeah So we're just going to cook this for a couple extra minutes. Now this, this is when we're going to add our parsley. it all together. Oh my god. It smells so good. But um don't discard your pasta water guys. Alright? Because we're gonna need that. Okay? bit right now. Not a lot. Just a little. Oh yeah. Alright. I'm gonna give this a few more minutes to come together guys. If you want you can add your chili flakes right now. But I don't know if everyone likes chili plates, so we're going to let them add it on their own. All right, but let me let this cook up for a couple more minutes. I'll be right back. I'm just going to top it off with a little parsley. And now, we can add your chili flakes. But there you have it, guys. That's the Leo pasta. Authentic and amazing. I'd like to thank you for being with us here, me and Gunchy, on another episode of Cooking with the Reaper, your heavy metal chef. God bless, and we will see you next time.